Uh, happy with how things went today? Yeah, I was. Uh, it was good to get out here and compete a little bit more, one more time, just to solidify whatever questions are out there, just try to move fluid, try to move fast. Uh, it's good to be out here with the boys, so yeah. What are the benefits of going through the position drills again? Uh, I think it's just determining, you know, I ran well at the combine, uh, ran fast, ran smooth, so now it's just how does he translate that to football? So getting out here again in their eye and just letting them know that I'm not only fast, you know, going forward in a straight line, but I'm also fast backpedaling, flipping my hips and running, et cetera, et cetera. So it just brings it all together. Do you get much feedback today or is it just sort of go from one drill to the next? Uh, I'm pretty it's probably just, you know, more so just solidifying things. I don't think it's anything um, surprising or anything shocking happens today, at least for me, just doing position drills. but. Maybe just checking up on, on some people's ideas about how I move and uh, probably just solidifying and just taking some extra notes, um, but nothing major, so. So how has the, between the combine and this, how did everything go? I mean, are you, you, you got to be pretty happy with the numbers and, and I'm sure you've had a lot of conversations with teams too. Yeah, I mean, working out there, as you, you came by, you saw we were working out there at TC Boost, so it all came together. It, it all paid off, I think. Preparation comes down to, to how you perform, and I prepared. I was ready for it. So going up and performing well, it's definitely a big weight off the shoulders. I feel like my tape was already out there. Did well at the Shrine. You know, did well at the Combine, position drills. So now it's just it's all in God's hands at this point. I did everything I can. It's all out of my control, and I made the best of it. A little bit, little bit of a relief now? I'd definitely say so. I mean, it, it's, it's one of those moments. It's being under the lights. You see people doing that when you're like five, six years old. So we know to get to that point and you know just put it all out there trusting yourself it's definitely a relief now i can just get back into football shape get back into doing what i got to do when i get to camp etc but it's definitely a relief just to know i did well know i did my best and, and know it paid off so what what is the plan over the next month and a half until the draft huh well like i said shifting it over to to football but also just taking some time to see some family go home for a little bit hang out with my with my mom stepdad Head out to Florida for a little bit, visit with my dad, you know, do some uh, training with him as well. Maybe take a weekend trip or so with, with the boys or something, you know, just trying to plan that out soon. But definitely getting back to the football shape and also just enjoying it because I heard that first season is the longest season. So definitely going to take some time to just enjoy family, enjoy friends for a little bit. But then, you know, just realizing that this is just the beginning. Right, thanks, man. Appreciate of course. It.